Hey guys, what's up? It's Mad. Um, today I decided to make a video of some of my favorite um, travel beauty essentials. I got this idea from Glossier actually a couple of days ago. They posted on Instagram what your top three um, travel beauty essentials were and I commented and I have a little bit more than three today. I have one, two, three, four, like six. I guess six is my lucky number because I think the last time I made a video, I said I would do five favorites and it ended up being um, six. So let's get started. So the first one I want to bring up are actually a Glossier product and it is the bomb.com. Um, I don't know if you guys follow Glossier. I definitely do. It's more of a natural looking skincare and beauty line. And they came out with these bomb.coms a couple of years ago. I wish they had better, more eco-friendly packaging, but Glossier, hopefully we can work on that. I have two different flavors. I actually, you guys probably saw my video of when I went to the Glossier pop-up, and that's when I got these. This is the new mango flavor and scent. Um, that's what was featured in the video that you guys saw. And this is also a big favorite. It's the birthday cake one. So this one, if you see it come out, it's tinted a little bit pink and it smells like mango. While the birthday cake one is clear, but it has a little bit of glitters in it. I don't think you can see it. And it smells just like birthday cake. So it's really nice. Um, it's really good to use daily. I use it, I bring it in my backpack wherever I go, so it's a really good um, thing to bring with you anywhere. Next are actually scrunchies. Wow, fail. Let's try this again. Yeah, scrunchies. Woohoo, woohoo. So I've been obsessed with scrunchies recently. I like them. Um, I like how they look in my hair, I like the extra pops of color and how roughly they are. I could put them with any different type of outfit, um, either as a pop of color or, you know, matching colors. They're very 90s reminiscent and they're really, they're better for your hair than like the normal hair ties. In my experience, they do less of an imprint on your hair, so. You can get them anywhere. I try to get them the cheapest as I can. This one's from Dollar Tree. This one's from Forever 21. And this one is from H&M. They were all like a dollar each. The next thing is actually a combination. It's just Lush products in general. I've been obsessed with Lush recently. And they have a lot of things that are really good to take traveling when you're on the go. So every time I go, I get samples. You can always get samples. It's an unlimited amount. But I wouldn't go crazy because they they're always busy so here i have a lotion and on this one i have a hand scrub but i've gotten shower gels and shampoos multiple times and this one is actually um, a shampoo bar which is great to have when you're traveling and on the go you can buy one of these tins there um i actually wouldn't recommend the tin i don't really like it my shampoo bar actually got stuck in here so Sorry, my cat. <laughs> um, but it's really great on your hair. Almost everything is all natural. Lots of things are vegan there as well. So it feels better, um, it smells better, and it's better for the environment. The next thing is actually the NYX Vinyl Eyeliner that I'm wearing right now. I love just keeping this in my backpack and putting on eyeliner anywhere that I go. I like it because it has a brush tip, which People are usually used to the felt tip, but this is more like a little paintbrush. Um, and you could put more on or less on. And then you can actually, be, since I'm an artist and I paint, like it's easier for me to make a line with this type of tip. And the liner actually is like smudge proof, so that's great. Um, it takes a little bit to get off, but totally worth it. I love it, I take it with me everywhere. It's only like $5, I think. My last one is actually this lip gloss that I stole from my mom, so hopefully she's not watching this video to see that I stole this. Um, it's by Pure Romance, which is actually like a 
a brand for adult toys and stuff like that. Um, but this is a lip gloss from there, from the Obsessed Collection, and it's called Crush. And I'll put it on right now for you guys. It's just not super sticky. It smells good and it looks very natural, which is something that I go for, as I said before, when it comes to like Glossier products. So as you can see, it doesn't have much of a tint, just very slight. And then it makes my lips look glossy, but they're not too sticky at all. Um, definitely kiss proof I've used it before um, and it just smells good I feel good and if I'm doing like a dewy look this is a really good lip gloss to use so yeah that's pretty much it um if you guys have any questions just leave them down below I will put all the links to these products in the description box below and please if you like the video like comment and subscribe and let me know what else you would like from me so I love you guys thanks so much for watching